Ooh, yes. I'm leaving this completely up to you. That is a huge loaded question. Where you host your website has huge impacts on a lot of factors. If you're gonna go with the, what I call the all you can eat hosting companies, typically, if you're especially on a low budget plan, you're going to be on there with thousands of other websites on the same server. So that will impact the performance of the server itself, which impacts how quickly your website loads. We call that page load speed. It also can affect if one of those websites gets compromised. There could be security implications or upgrading the website if you want to be running the latest version of whatever software it is that your website relies on. If you're a WordPress website, we call that the LAMP stack, which is, you know, the Linux, Apache, PHP, MySQL. It's a bunch of, you know, alphabet soup. But the point is that software, the framework, the underlying software can affect upgrading that. So I think it does make a difference on that. So there, there also are some websites that are more um, hardened, they're more secure. So a lot of websites out there give you a thing called cPanel, which is your control panel that you can do anything on, and I think they're great, absolutely. But I don't think it's always the right answer. I think there's a lot of situations where you want to minimize the potential security exposure, the risk, any vulnerabilities that your website has and the less moving parts it has, the less little ways of configuring things or doodads that your website has, the, the more efficient it's going to be, the more secure it's gonna be, the more responsive it's going to be. And guess what? This is something that Greg can comment on, is that Google is making a very huge shift, especially this year, to page load speed. Yeah, that's, I mean, we've, we've noticed over the last, there's a target in what, mind too, six right? Six months, we've noticed. Um, Google's released what they call the Core Web Vitals program. Um, you can get to it through Webmaster Tools if you're using Webmaster Tools on your website. Um, what they're doing is they're actually testing your site on a mobile framework as well as a desktop framework to see how quickly pages load, to see whether the content on the screen moves around while it's loading, to make sure that the experience of the user is the best it can possibly be if your link is going to be returned on the front page of Google search results. Google doesn't want to send people to links that are slow or glitchy. They want the, the experience to be good. The problem is most sites are not hosted on servers that can meet the requirements of this new platform. The majority. <laughs> change that Google's making. In fact, most, even our own site, we struggle to make it fit within what Google sees as the future of performance on a website. Um, yeah, making sure you're on the right hosting plan and the right host is important. It's that simple. Yep. So, Hey, while that thing is pointed at me, thanks for watching. Don't forget to mash the button, bell, subscribe, link thing right there.